see you. Fight. Ha! You phoned her. Ah, Geralt. How are things? <coughs> Farewell, Uncrate. Everything in order? Damn it. Downright to fear to sneeze near these barrels. Bring all your tools with you? Thought to myself, a battle approaches. Blades will need honing. Plate will need some hammering. That sort of thing. Thought right. Thanks, Sultan. Plan to top that by brewing some more Mahakam and Mix. Shade so volatile you need but glance at it to set it off like a flaming fart. Very useful during sieges. Willing to craft something for me? Of course. Provided you have a diagram. We'll talk later, Zoltan. I certainly hope this gas will work. Wolf? Anair! Anadar! Volanda! Ha-em! Ha-em! Whoever repaired these walls did a shoddy job of it. What's the gas for? It's highly flammable. I aim to detonate it, incinerate a few of the hunt's riders in the process. Castle walls won't suffer? A fortress walls are in ruin. They cannot be harmed any more than they already are. We're not masons. A shame. We'll not be able to keep the hunt outside the fortress. That's no loss. We don't know much about breaking sieges either. We'll face them in the courtyard. She's one of us, Geralt. No way we'll let him take her. Damn piece of junk. Younger than Vesemir. Any Geralt? progress? Just can't get this thing to fling a bolt. They'll sooner appoint me Hierarch of Novigrad. Ready for battle? I was born ready. Esco. Greetings, Wolf. Esco. Need some peace. You gotta prepare. See you. Huh. Set out alone, Vess tracked me down. Insisted on coming. I ought to give you a hiding for not asking my help. But I took it all out in roach along the way. Ah, some old friends. What's this horse son doing here? We need him. You might have forgotten what he did. I haven't. To save Siri, whatever the cost, and Letho's faced the hunt before. I don't question his abilities. I simply don't trust him. Letho won't betray us. <laughs> You're naive. Always have been. Usually I don't give a shit, but this time it could kill Vess and me both. Think this through before it's too late. We'll stay and help. But we don't want him at our backs.
Greetings, Geralt. If I'm to die today, I wish to look smashing for the occasion. Getting all gussied up for the wild hunt? Women only ever beautify themselves for their own satisfaction. Glad you're here. It's good to see you again. Expected you earlier. I started off heading in the opposite direction, but then turned around. What made you change your mind? There are times when a woman should simply not explain her decision. That goes doubly for sorceresses. Get everybody together. Time to talk. Thank you for coming. The Wild Hunt will be here soon. They're coming for Ciri. Want to take her? We'll stop them. How do you even know the hunt will show? They always know where I teleport to. And they move from place to place in an instant. So what's our plan? There aren't many of us, but I'd trust any of you with my life. Work together and we'll defeat the hunt. When they attack, Yen will dome the fortress with a magic shield. Hunt will be forced to land outside the walls. If they're dispersed out in the woods, we could hunt down small groups of riders. Got our first volunteer for the hunting party. I'm the second. Count me in, too. Always believed attack is the best defense. The hunt will try to penetrate into the fortress through navigator portals. I can do nothing against this kind of magic, so you'll need to find and close as many as you can while hunting in the woods. Lambert will make us die meridian bombs. Remember the formula? Of course. Excellent. Erden should work on the portals as well. I shall also give you each an amulet. Snap them in half and you'll become invisible, at least while you remain still or move slowly. Move abruptly, engage any foes, clash with them, and they will see you. Apart from that, they will be able to hear you and smell you. If you come across a large unit, do not attack. Signal Triss, and she will provide support. I'll look for your signal. Soon as I see it, I'll rain fire on the forest. Ciri's most important in all of this. The hunt's after her, and we have to defend her at all costs. What do I do? Stay inside the keep. If they break through, come inside. We'll all converge to help you. Out of the question. I can look after myself. No one doubts that, child. But remember the most important moment when hunting a monster? Wait for an opportunity. After the council, I'll give you an amulet. If you use it, a ball of fire will land where you're standing, just in case. Remember, there's only a few of us. We have to help each other, work together. If anything goes wrong and the hunt puts us on the defensive, we pull back, make a stand at the gates of the fortress. The inner courtyard is our last line of defense. If we don't stop them there, we're doomed. What else do we have that we can use? Since you plan to ambush the hunt in the woods, I could dig some trapping pits, blue stripe style. Meaning? Deep as the dark abyss, bottoms bristling with sharpened stakes. I brought this, my Hakiman mix. Flammable as bone dry saltpeter and plowing sticks to Erethan. We fill some barrels, stack them in a narrow passage, and fire them up at an opportune moment. You know we stand on a vast deposit of gas. If need be, I could open cracks in the earth, create explosions. I would need to prepare, though. There's the laboratory and the workshop. One thing to remember, we've got limited resources and even less time. We ought to decide what kind of weaponry will be most useful against the hunt. Absolutely. 
We need to assign one type of weaponry each to the lab and workshop. Who needs access to the lab? I started brewing some potions. I'd like to finish, if you don't mind. I could prepare more of those witcher's traps, but I'd need all the lab equipment. Always relied on potions. We should brew as many as possible. Let's talk about the workshop. Been wanting to fix that breach in the wall, but we'll need the same tools to clear the rubble from the armory. Rubble? Haven't you heard? Roof caved in a couple of years back. There's some excellent swords in there. Swords we could use. Filling in the breach seems just as important. They come through there, the siege will be over awfully quick. Fixing the breach in the wall's a priority. We won't have time to do much else. Everything settled? Yes, settled. We don't have much time, so let's get to work. Let's sum up. Yennefer will create a magic barrier to repel the main assault. That should push the opposing force into the woods, where Lambert, Geralt, and Letha will be waiting. They'll use Dimeridium to close the navigator's portals, stop as many warriors as possible from entering the fortress. Triss will be waiting for their signal, then give the riders hell. All others will repel any foes who make it inside the fortress walls. If anything goes wrong, we abandon the outer courtyard, pull back to the keep. Remember, Aridan can't get his hands on Ciri. That's most important. Let's look at the map of the fortress, figure out the details. Can't help feeling we've overlooked something important. Don't think about it. What's ready? Haven't had much time to prepare, so not much, honestly. Your potions. Thanks. For everything. I'll saddle the horses. Come once you're ready to head into the woods. Taking Letho with us. You know my opinion. Serious talk coming. They're after you. No matter what happens, you can't put yourself in danger. Want me to sit and wait while others risk their lives for me? Listen to me this once. Don't take matters into your own hands. Don't treat me like a child. Didn't even do that when you were one. I like it when you smile. Come here. Everything will be all right.
see that. It's starting. Woods, now. Gonna have to thank Yen once this is all over. That spell... really something. And the invisibility. Hounds could sniff you out, so don't get too close. And you'll be visible as soon as you start fighting. Remember that. He always talked this much. Only when he's nervous. Good work with these bombs, by the way. Aim at the portals. Be precise. I'm out of Dimeridium. Yen mentioned casting the Erden at the rifts. Said the sign could seal them. They're here. Time to say hello. Slow down. Element of surprise is key. Stay hidden. Give Triss a chance to show them what she can do. Then we'll hit him. Mean to say Marigold can conjure up more than a cloud of butterflies. Lots more. Wait and see. Next time you get the feeling I'm about to piss off Marigold, make sure and knock me upside the head.
Not that I don't trust this in I'm sold. Geralt! Come here! Look! They're regrouping! See the commander? Name's Imlarith. I remember him from back when I rode the hunt. Damn it. Spells ringing. We're becoming visible. We're gonna try to kill him. Too risky. Pansy. What's with Marigold? Shit. You were meant to wait inside! I refuse to sit idle while you risk your lives for me. Back inside! No! Geralt gave the signal from the woods and Triss hasn't cast the spell. Damn it! All right, run to him. Marigold will shield us! Wonder if it took him out. Gimlerith? Doubt it. Large detachment approaching from the woods! We need to close the gate before they get inside. Down! 
Strength is waning. Heads up. Open that gate. Hasn't done it yet. Means he'll be fine. We've got Triss to worry about now. to get in through the main gate. I'm afraid they could succeed next time.
it too. Retreat beyond it! Fall back! You're not supposed to be out here. Too late now. They're coming in through the gaps! Time Iridium bombs. You'll find more in the crates by the walls. Earth! Hold them back! I must form a circle of vitality! Gotta close the portals. If we don't, we die.
I... I was too late to help him. It's not your fault. I should not have fled here to Kemoan. Avalark is weak, but alive. Triss is tending to the others. I nearly killed you. Killed everyone. Zemir's funeral. We should prepare. Yourself. No witcher's ever died in his own bed. You don't know how it is to see someone you love die because of you, for you. We all knew what we were signing up for. Yes, and you saved me. For how long? A week? A month? We'll hide you, cover your tracks. No. I will flee no more. Vafail. For those who remain, death should never take precedence over life. Pay your last respects to your friend. Then we must hold counsel. What's on your mind? Care Morin. 
Can't imagine this place without Vesemir. I'll head down the valley soon, then find somewhere else to winter next year. Come on, it's the only home we've ever had. Stay. No, Geralt. Place has been dying a while. Last nail in the coffin today. Time we accepted that. Thank you. <laughs> Please. She was my ward, too. And the old should only ever stick around to help the young. You know, this hardly ends your struggle. I know. Whatever you aim to do now, remember you'll find souls willing to aid you in Skellige. Myself, Krach, his children. Thanks. I'll remember that. I shall take another look at the wounded, but I'll need to go soon. I'll leave you some medicines. Go in hell, Thermion. Till we meet again. So? Tell me. I can say I've seen it all now. I still don't believe everything that happened. Risked your lives for me. How can I repay you? We'll think of something. Right? Definitely. What will you do? We're bound for Novigrad. To fight the next fight. If you miss us, look for us at the camp. <sighs> that was tough. We managed. Thanks for helping. You're welcome. What will you do now? Probably head east, cross the mountains. After that, we'll see. Farewell. There you are. Crying shame about Vesemir. I'm sorry. Thanks for your help. I had a debt to pay. Heading straight back to Skellige? Wouldn't be right to tarry. War with the Black Ones won't wait. You can count on me, you know. Always. I know. Thanks. Come to see how I'm feeling. Thanks. Not bad. That's good. Ah, son. Horrible about Vesemir. I know you were close. Thanks. We were. Listen, far be it from me to stick my beard, but it'll no scratch an itch. So don't take this the wrong way. I want to help, whatever you decide, but to my mind, we've got to counterattack. I've got to find the hunt, Eredin, and charge at them both like a bull at a heifer. Not that simple, unfortunately. We have no way of finding them. They find us easily. Can take us by surprise whenever they want. Forgive me, Geralt, but that's the blathering of a man who clearly can't snap out of it after a tragic loss. Drink it off. Sleep it off, whatever it takes. Just get yourself together and think things through. I'll do that, Sultan. Thanks for everything you did for me and Siri. May I be honest? Had I known what would happen here, I'd never have come anywhere near Kaer Morhen. I'm glad I could help, but I shall leave as soon as Lambert feels better. You going together? I've an idea, but I need a Witcher to help me see it through. Lambert has agreed to assist me. Hmm. <laughs> Good luck, and thanks again. We're even now. Can we talk? What about? Holding up all right? I love questions like that. Am I holding up? What? My dick? This is shit, Geralt, and you know it. 
I knew the old man couldn't live forever. Even told Eskel that when it came time, I'd get his sword. Fits my hand perfectly, you know? But... Vesemir deserved a better death. Whereas he died like a louse. Crushed. We'll avenge him. Doesn't look that rosy to me. Try not to get into any arguments, can you? They've all come here to help. Are you gonna tell me how to behave now? No, just asking you nicely. Well, how's this for a nice answer? Kiss my ass. Sheesh. You haven't changed a lick. That disappointment I hear? No. Surprise, maybe. Most grow gentler with age. Seems you're growing pricklier. Mom always said I was different. Had some other adjectives in mind, but different will do. See you later. Yeah, take care. Zirel can harness immense amounts of the power. Why has no one taught her to control this? Actually, some did teach her. Clearly, to no effect. I'll gladly argue with you about this. Some other time. Haven't had a chance to talk. Thanks for your help. And for looking after Siri. You will thank me later. Now we must take Cyril from here, Haida. And then gather a greater force. Anyone, everyone we could count on came here to care Morhen. Which is why we must seek the help of enemies. Magic is our best defense against the hunt. We need sorceresses. Arch mistresses of magic. You mean the Lodge? Many of the Lodge's members are dead. The rest are in hiding. Philippa Eilhart, Margarita Loantil, and Frangilla Vigo are likely still alive. And Francesca and Ida? Think they'd agree? I think they'll take convincing. Would you rather speak to Kira alone? That would probably be best. I don't want the Lodge anywhere near Siri. Just don't trust those women. What would you have us do instead? Fight alone and die a beautiful but pointless death? No, Geralt. By some miracle, we survived that fight, eking out a measly victory at enormous cost. No more guerrilla warfare. Time to face the enemy in open battle. I've made an agreement with the Emperor. In exchange for its help, the Lodge will be granted amnesty and find asylum in Nilfgaard. That will be our bargaining chip. Triss, I wish to leave today to find the sorceresses. Will you help me? Of course. Even got an idea where you could start. Damn it! Again you planned without even asking what I think. I've had enough of this. I won't be taken somewhere like a bundle. I will not sit and twiddle my thumbs. I am sick of waiting, sick of hiding. You're right. Prove today you can take care of yourself. Easier to pat someone on the back and hope things will work out than it is to face the truth. Jirel possesses a great power she cannot control. She is a danger to herself, to others. Until she learns to control it, she should remain isolated. First of all, bollocks. Second, if you're going to speak of courage, at least address me directly and not through Geralt. I'm gone. Better go after her. Wait, she needs time. We must let her resolve her grief on her own. Then we should start training as soon as possible. She must learn to control her abilities. This training really necessary? You saw what happened. She could be a greater threat than the hunt. Fine. We'll stay here a while longer, then join you and Triss in Novigrad. Meet at Dandelion's Inn. Come on, Yen. The sooner we leave, the better. See ya.
looking, don't you see? Discouraged after a mere eight attempts? Sierra. How many times must I try? As many as it takes. But I'm not getting anywhere. We shall return to this later. Didn't make it far first time out on the gauntlet either. Geralt, please, not now. By comparison, the gauntlet was a walk in the park. But that's not the point. What is? Avalach says nothing will come of this until I stop thinking about the battle. But at the moment, I find it impossible to fill my head with kittens and vanilla pudding. Tell me, how do you do it? What? Always manage to pull yourself together. Focus. No matter what's happening. Hmm. There's a certain ancient method. Vesemir taught it to me, and Barman taught it to him. Will you take me into the mountains and make me drink hemlock? The Skellica druids have used it for centuries. It always works. Hey! You'll regret that! Hey! That's cheating! <laughs> Wimp. We'll see about that. <laughs> Come and get me. Done playing nice. Right. That really works. Thanks. Glad to be of service. So what now? I'll go see where our dearest sage is. Saddled the horses. Siri, it's the crack of dawn. Where do you want to go? To Velen, Bald Mountain. But a few days till the Witch's Sabbath. And guess who's the guest of honor? Dunno. Enlighten me. 
Imerith. We'll have no better chance to get him. Where'd you get this idea? What's gotten into you? I must avenge Vesemir. The Sabbath. It's the perfect opportunity. Imlarith will be drunk among his cohorts, caught up in the revelry. He'll not expect the blow. How do you learn all this? Imlarith? The Sabbath? Avilach. He told me of those who chase us. Claims knowledge itself can tip the scales. Come. We shall talk on the way. Wait. Something I gotta tell you before we go. You know, the Emperor really wanted you found. Yennefer mentioned something. Wanted you to visit him. Why would you tell me now? Because this could be your last chance to see your... father. Think I should go? Ought to decide for yourself. But I want your opinion. Should I go or not? Probably just wants to talk. How can you be sure? What if he wants something more? Promised me he wouldn't force you to do anything. So I should go? He is your father. Vizima is on the way. I suppose we can drop in. Ready? Let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri, who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. Majesty, Geralt of Rivia, and... Cyrilla Fiona Ellen Rhiannon, Queen of Sintra, Princess of Bruges, and Duchess of Sotten. Heiress to Innes Ard Skellig and Innes Ann Skellig, and Suzerain of Atra and Abiara. Get used to it. Before long, every soul from Nilfgaard to the Dragon Mountains will kneel before you. I did not expect you to keep your word, Witcher. I always keep my word. As do I. Your reward. didn't come to collect on a deal. You asked me to bring your daughter here. I did just that. Siri will hear you out, then we leave. Are you sure? Never again would you need to stalk monsters while wading through sewage. I'm sure. I understand. Honor prevents you from accepting coin. In that case, a stallion, a thoroughbred milf guardian, awaits you in the stables. Treat it as an expression of my gratitude. Thank you. Now forgive me. I wish to speak to my daughter. Follow me, sir.
White Wolf, good to see you. Greetings, General. You had no trouble crossing the Ponta, I trust. None. I take it you crossed via the ford near Banglin? It's fortunate you did not choose to ride through Rhind. A troubled region still. Radovid seeks to breach the front in the west. But he'll not succeed. Not before the princess becomes empress and we bring order to the area. Siri hasn't agreed to that yet. Yes, of course, she's tactful, not one to celebrate an offer not yet made. But this is not the kind of offer one refuses. Indeed. Can you imagine? I thought only the wine-addled minds of bards and poets could give birth to such stories. The prodigal daughter of the most powerful ruler in the continent's history returns on the eve of his final triumph to embrace her inheritance. <laughs> Simpletons adore such stories as they do the princesses, ever beautiful and delicate who are Geralt, we're leaving. So nice to see you, my lady. Likewise. Time we were on our way. A shame you can't stay. I hope to continue this on another occasion. That makes one of us. Well? If he thinks he can buy me, he is sorely mistaken. He offer anything specific? Yes, very specific. And thoroughly absurd. Sorry, I don't want to talk about it. Not now, at least. Won't pressure you. When you're ready, let's go. After the Battle of Kaer Morhen, the defenders licked their wounds and mourned their losses, save Ciri, who began to plan her revenge. She woke Geralt one night and urged him to travel with her to Velen, to the top of Bald Mountain, where she knew she'd find Imlarith. She had decided he had to die. The men at Crow's Perch, they spoke of this place. Ard Serbin, home of the ladies of the wood. The peasants feared coming here, and the Baron thought the ladies of the wood a terrifying tale for naughty children. Incidentally, I wonder how the Baron is. Hanged himself after his wife died. Daughter's in Novigrad. A true shame. We stand to find Imlarith here. You sure? Avalok told me of beings who commune with the NL Elves. They can be found in every part of our world. In Velen, the Crones do this. Apparently, Imlarith came here at Eridin's behest, to order the Crones to keep their eyes open and ears pricked, in case Avalok were to seek shelter in his Velen hideout. Took the order literally, judging by all the ears hanging in the woods. Think Imlarith might still be here? He craves the pleasures of the flesh, wine, sex. The crones indulge him, flatter his ego. I'm certain he'd not let this opportunity pass, and will be on Bull Mountain for the Sabbath. You actually know this area? Centuries ago, it was a hallowed site for druids. But then the crones arrived, destroyed the Velen Circle, and deformed the Sacred Oak atop the mountain. An important feast is observed here annually. The Sabbath, they call it. All the local folk attend. I suspect Imlarith attends too, as the Crone's guest. Seem to know it well. Avalok's a good tutor. <laughs> 